bags are fully stocked. My name is Burf and this is my turf. I'm straight out of the thrift store. Hey, what's up? It's your boy Burf. And I am at Thrift Giant in Louisville today because yesterday, a friend of mine, Carson, the guy that's always getting the drop on me in my neck of the woods over here, always invading my territory when I'm not looking, he found some vintage 80s toys, found a vintage 80s Battle Cat, two vintage 80s Tauntauns, and a vintage 80s Dewback from Star Wars. He told me he snagged them just as they were bringing them out from the back room, which was, I think, maybe around 4.30, 5 o'clock yesterday. So it got me thinking, well, you know, where there's one or two or three or four, sometimes there's five, six, seven, or eight of those things. So I'm here this morning bright and early to get the drop on Carson and see if maybe between like 4.30 and this morning, they brought some more vintage toys out from the back. You never know, you know, it's, it's worth the drive over here to check. So we're gonna head in there and see what kind of goodies they got. Keep our fingers crossed and pray that the vintage thrift store gods are good to us today. All right, let's see what we got on the shelves. They look bare. And what do we got here? We got some sort of transformer. And what do we got here? We got some sort of dancing or talking Frankenstein. Does he work? No. And what do we got here? We got a Black Panther. And what's this? Flora Bell. 1987, huh? All right, well, I'll check and see if it's worth anything. And what do we got here? We got an Eeyore, a Gravedigger monster truck. Wow, look at this thing. Holy crap, that thing is huge. The heck is that? I've never, never seen that. I don't know what toy line that belongs to. Busted. Damn you, Carson. Damn you, Carson. Well, I'm gonna go hit up Goodwill next. And then what I think we're gonna do is we're gonna shoot on over to Irving. And we're gonna go check out Texas Thrift today and see if they got any goodies on the shelves. It's been probably a couple of months since I've been there. So that'll be an interesting trip. Let's head to Goody Will. All right, my friends, we are here. <laughs> what you got for me today, Goody Will? What you got for me today? Fingers crossed, Goodwill Gods. Be good to me today. All right, let's see what we got. Oh, we got some stuff on the shelves. This is cool. This rhino figure. All right, possibility. I'll check out this vehicle right here. That's pretty cool. And then we've got this, I guess this may be from Animal Planet, 12 inch Batman. And we've got an Iron Man and another Batman. And what's this back here? Oh, I bet you that probably goes to this. Let's shove it in there. Oh, check out this gun. <laughs> oh, wow, look at that thing. Laser tag. That's pretty cool. And we've got this Triceratops and looks like maybe a Brontosaurus or something. Oh, look, he's got some articulation. And yeah, there they are together. Check that out. What's this back here? 99 cents. I don't know what that is. Oh, and this is maybe some sort of a Monster High vehicle, huh? Actually, this is from the Disney movie, The Princess and the Frog. And I see people trying to sell it for about 15, 20 bucks, but only one has been sold. It was brand new in the box and it sold for about 50. I'm gonna pass on this. All right, well, let's go check the glass case. All right, anything in the glass case? Uh, we got some sort of remote control motorcycle, but it doesn't look like anything else. Busted again. All right, up next, Texas Thrift. All right, my friends, we are here. What is this? This isn't the Texas Thrift I normally go to. The GPS took me someplace new. All right, well, this is exciting. So we're gonna head in here and see what kind of goodies they got. Maybe they got cooler toys than the other Texas Thrift. Fingers crossed, as always, Thrift Gods. Be good to me today. All right, well, let's see what we got on the shelves. We got a Jurassic World dinosaur, I think. What else? We got this marble bucket. It's kind of neat. All right, well, they got a little bag, uh, a wall of bags here, just a small one. I got a Smurf. 
And what are these figures? Those are kind of neat. And what's this? Uh, some sort of construction set, maybe. All right, well, this Texas thrift is weak, but I did pick up those dinosaurs. I'm gonna see if I can find the other Texas thrift. All right, let's do a little show and tell first. All right, this is what I picked up. I thought these things were really unique. I've never seen them before. And uh, what's kind of cool is that like this guy here, his wings fold down and when you hit that little button, his wings flap open. So we got him and then we got this dude over here that's wearing some sort of bellhop type of outfit. And then I don't know if this guy is part of the same line or not, but yeah, these things are really cool, man. And uh, I picked them up for $6. Pretty happy with the score. All right, so I'm gonna plug Texas Thrift back into the GPS and hopefully it's not too far from here. And we could hit that up, Goodwill and Thrift Giant. They're all together, like within like, you know, walking distance of each other. So let's head that way. All right, my friends, we are here. <laughs> And we are actually here. But hey, you know, we're here and that's all that matters. Fingers crossed, thrift gods be good to me today. All right, well, let's see what we got on the shelves. Any goodies? We got any goodies? Well, it looks like the bags are fully stocked, so that's good. We got a stegosaurus. And we got like some little robin plush in there. That's kind of cool. And we've got a bag of dinosaurs. Looks like this is like glow in the dark or something. Let me check out this guy here. He's, uh, he's got some articulation in him. And we've got a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. I think I have that one already. Oh, and here's another turtle, but he's missing his hand. And this bag's got a How to Tame Your Dragon Dragon and a dinosaur. Oh, we've got a Power Ranger in there. Are there any more? No, just that one. But what's this? Oh, looks like some sort of Fortnite figure. And we've got some sort of crocodile. It looks kind of vintage. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, check this out. What is this? That guy's kind of unique looking. I don't know if that's like from a Disney movie, but he's like, I got a, he's got a bear's face and then like these dragon wings. Yeah, that might be worth picking up. Ooh, we got a Mach 5. And what's this right here? Looks like some sort of Power Ranger. Hmm, that's neat looking. Oh, and then we got this guy here. Oh, he's a core action figure. Hmm. And now we got this dude right here. What's this guy right here? Oh, we got... Got some army action figures in there, that's cool. And then we also have a Star Wars, so I think I'm gonna grab this. Oh, check this dude out. Oh, he's pretty heavy, actually. Oh, look at this. We got a dragon and like a brontosaurus. Actually, I don't know if that's a brontosaurus. It might be that other saurus thing, but yeah, these are cool. Oh, what's this over here? He's got articulation, looks like his mouth opens. I haven't seen one like that. Very interesting. All right, well, I pulled a few scores out of here, so I'm gonna go check out, and then we'll do a little show and tell, and then we'll hit up Goodwill. All right, well, that dragon is actually made out of rubber. I love toys that are made out of rubber. They're so awesome. Well, let's take a look. All right, well, this is the haul that I just pulled out of those bags. So we've got this guy right here, this dinosaur. Check out this dragon, man. Look as the sunlight hits him. He just really lights up. Wow, this thing is like super cool. And I love dragons, so he'll go very nicely in my collection. Then I got these three action figures down here. These army guys, they have articulation. Some sort of gorilla. I don't know who this guy is. And I don't know who this guy is either. Maybe you guys can help me out and let me know what movie or what cartoon he's from. And then we also have a Star Wars figure down here. Oops. It's Obi-Wan Kenobi and uh, young Obi-Wan, right? Or is that Anakin? No, I think that's young Obi-Wan. <laughs> I don't know some of the, the newer Star Wars, you know, I'm an old school kind of guy. 
And then we got this really awesome Power Ranger back here. Let me get these guys out of the way so we don't have all this, so we don't have all this blur. But yeah, this is the Power Ranger right here. He's actually from 2006. Pretty sweet. All right, let's head on over to Goody Will and see what kind of goodies they got. All right, my friends, we are here. <laughs> what you got for me today, Goody Will? What you got for me today? Man, I'd love to score some vintage 80s toys here right around Christmas. It would be epic. It would be so epic. Fingers crossed. Vintage Goodwill Gods be good to me today. All right, what do we got on the shelves? At first glance, I'm not seeing much of anything. What's this thing? Hmm. What is that? It almost looks like some sort of stagecoach or something. Well, it extends forward. And it looks like it might hold like Hot Wheels cars or something like that. Man, I really wish I knew what this was because I'm going to pass on it because I don't know what it is and I don't want to take a risk on it. I've never seen anything like it. it kind of reminds me of something out of the Flintstones or something like that. But yeah, there's no markings on it to like really be able to tell what it is. So maybe you guys can help me out. Comment below if I'm making a mistake passing this thing up. And really the only other thing here is this Optimus Prime, which he's kind of cool. Busted. Man, it kind of sucks sometimes when you don't know what things are. <laughs> and then you're just wondering like, was it valuable? Should I have picked it up? Was it rare? Who knows? Hey, say la vie. All right, let's hit up Thrift Giant next and that will be our final destination today. All right, my friends, final destination. Old Thrifty Pants. Fingers crossed, thrift gods, be good to me today. All right, let's see what we got in here. All right, let's see what we got. At first glance, it looks pretty weak. Oh wow, check that out. That is pretty cool. <laughs> and what do we got here? We've got some safari animals. And what's this? Oh, it's some sort of nativity scene. Oh, what's this? Is this an action figure? Oh yeah, it's a shredder. I wonder how much they're asking for him. I don't see a price tag on him. They probably won't sell him to me. Oh, look, I found it, $1.99. All right, well, let's pick this guy up. Oh, hey, check this out. This is really cool. Oh, wow. Yeah, I might have to get that. I think they just want $1.99 for it. That's pretty sweet. All right, guys, well, the only thing we pulled out of there was this shredder. He's a little banged up, but that's okay. That's what, that, that, that's what my purpose in life is. It's to rescue banged up toys from the thrift store. <laughs> but hey, if you enjoyed watching this content as much as I enjoyed making it for you, do me a favor, smash the like button. I would really appreciate that. That like button is so important. It really helps me out. Let's YouTube know that you like the content. And then with that information, they might, they might show it to some other people that have similar interests. So I would appreciate you hitting that like button. Also give me a follow on Instagram and tickety talk at 80s toys rock and rock is spelled R O C. In the meantime, I'll catch you on the flip side.